Hello Fluffy Tales, I'm the Serious Squirrel and welcome back to Alan Wake. In the last episode we defeated Lumberjacks with big axes and also Rusty with a big axe. And now we are continuing right where we left off and I think it's going to be even... Oh. Hello performance, could you please come back to me, thank you. Uh, I think it's going to be even harder from here on out, but we'll see. Let's not predict the future too soon. And there's a page. Let's get the page. Have a page. Uh, page. Wake sees the torch I symbol. The corner, afraid of what the flashlight's beam might reveal. Suddenly, a roughly painted symbol of a torch glowed in the light. Behind it, hidden by a rock, sat a battered metal trunk. It was here for a reason. Packed with supplies. Batteries, flares, ammo. Things you need to make it through the darkness of the night. Something left behind by someone who knew what I knew. And more. Maybe by the author of the story? Who knew? Anyway, you might see I haven't shaven in a few days. Because I just don't care at the moment. Oh, there is an, there is an accent again. There is an X again. I don't like axes. Anyway, yeah, I, I haven't shaved. And I'm just... To what's the word? Don't see the necess necessity of it all. Uh, there is a bloody blanket. I hate it when I don't remember words. But sometimes that happens, fluffy tails. And Ugh. well, that's a hammer. Hey guys, what up, guys? Uh, hello. You guys sure are. Um, hello? Um. I would. I would love to. Ah! Ouch. Ouch. I'm. Well. That didn't go too good, did it? Didn't. All right, let's let's try that again with a loaded gun this time, and freshly packed. I saw you, Mr. Shadow Man, behind there. Come out. Um. Yeah, I feel like. Uh. Like I should kill that guy first, and I'm already in a place where I don't want to be. And I have the feeling that I have to do it without any help. Well, they're coming now. That's good, I think, because now I'm closer to the light. And can actually run back to the light where I can hide if things go shitty for me. Hey guys, bust off. Okay, so they despawn, but they respawn here. All right. That's, that's fine for me though. Because if I kill this guy, I might just be able to. Kill the others? Question mark? I hope they don't respawn every time. No, looks like it stays that way. Okay, I can live with that. Reload. Reload some more. Alright. Um, don't like that Alan is doing the dodgy move still. Just because that means... Oh no, he stopped. Okay. 
Well, I think I'm safe. Hopefully. Hopefully they don't respawn now. For now, it looks like I could be good. What's over there? Is there something over there? Might there be something? Nope. There's nothing. Okay. Fine. Good. I don't want anything anyways. Uh, there is a light. Uh, I'm going to reply to you later, Ryan. I'm just recording, so... Shout out to Mostly Harmless for interrupting my... recording. Hey there, Ryan. Uh, I'm running back. I don't want to run back. I want to run in this direction. I want to run here. And there's a page. Lava's Peak is in this direction, so I get the page through. There is no page. It just looked like a page. And I think this is... Yep, this is close. There is a page, but I can't get to that page yet. So we are going here. Question mark? Yes. I think so. There's a coffee thermos. Probably going to be lots of enemies. Uh, yeah, I can read that without clicking on it. Thank you very much. Um, hum, 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 hum. Where, where do I go? Do I even go here? I think I'm wrong. I might be wrong. Hmm. Going into all the wrong directions in the moment. Oh, I can I can just jump over there. Alright. I dig that. Can can I take that? Pick the manuscript page. Read the manuscript page. Nightingales arrived. Agent Nightingale didn't want to be in Bright Falls. These little communities revolted him, and he didn't like the trees or the coffee. He now knew that impossible horrors lurked behind the storefronts and smiles. He desperately wanted to turn the car around and just drive until he passed out or ran out of road and booze. But he had a job to do. He had a rider to catch, at any cost. Right. Seems like there is a detective behind us. Not good. Not good at all. Um, checkpoint. Checkpoint. Oh, let me guess. This is going to break. No. I'm good. Okay. Well, I'm waiting for this then. That's fine. Use the... I don't know what this is called. Remain... Oh, Kevin. Cabin? Alright. Swing cabin! What? Shit, what? Oh, birds! Fucking birds! Shadow people. Hello, guys. Uh oh. Whoever just saved me, thank you very much. Come on, we gotta get moving. More of them coming. That flashlight's kid stuff. I know. The flares will keep the bastards away. You can see them too? I see him. Come on, we gotta move. Why? <laughs> because that's the way the story goes. Yeah, but let's move. I lost my gun back there. Oh, I've got a gun. Just keep that light steady on him. It took a moment, but then I recognized him. He'd been on the ferry when I first arrived here with Alice. He knew my name. 
We were headed in the direction of Lover's Peak. There was no way this was a coincidence. He was the kidnapper. Come on, Wake. You better keep up. You set him up, and I'll knock him down, Wake. Yeah, hopefully. Hopefully you're doing good, shithead. Oi, buddy, you shooting the wrong one. Dude. More flares are always good. And if you please could kill all of those guys, I would be horribly thankful. You're a horrible shot. You are a horrible shot, man. Oh, there are more coming. Yeah, no can do. Nick. Are you kidding? Give me the gun. No time for back. Okay. A little longer. Scare them off. Let's do that then. Uh, they are attacking. Um, could you, could you, could you, could you hurry up, please? Yep, yeah, that's fine. Move it. Save point. Gibby. Oh, checkpoint reached. Where are you, buddy? Buddy, why? Wow. feeling better now, Wake. All cozy and safe. Why am I calling you buddy? You're an asshole. They'll be on us soon. Shut it. Coffee thermos. Getting that. I bet there was a page down there, and I can't get it now because of this asshole. This is it, Wake. The last stand. Oh. Give me the goddamn gun! They're coming! That's not how this goes. Get with the program, Wake. Which program? What are you talking about? I wish you would be better at shooting, guy. And I wish I would be better at dodging. Dude. Shoot stuff. Don't just stand there. Man. Oh, they're coming from the back too? Great. Just great. Could you? Thank you. No, it wasn't. Still not done. I don't have any flares anymore. I'm going to die. 
Yep. I think I'm going to save some of the flares. God damn it! Buddy, you are horrible at shooting. Why the fuck are you dressed like a hunter? Uh, go away, you shitheads. Uh, could I please? Shoot them. Shoot them. Shoot them. Thank you. No, it's not a piece of cake. They are still coming. You idiot. Why is he so keen on them? Coming. Not even talking about the sexual relationship there. Whoa, shit! Oh, I forgot about that guy. Back, shh. Back. Go away. You monster. Yep. I agree with you on that. Are we done now? Yes. Let's Thank fuck. Now. Where's my wife? I knew you were gonna say that. I read it all before. You're a hell of a writer. Congratulations. You're gonna bring about something glorious and terrible once we get you some uh, proper editorial control. What the hell are you talking about? Where's Alice? I want the entire manuscript, or she's gonna suffer bad. You touch her all. Idiots, both of them. Gun. Well, Fluffy Tales, I'm going to end the episode here just because uh, it's already 20 minutes and I think I have a lot of cutting to do. Um, yeah. I hope you had fun, there was some action, no shooting action though, and yeah, maybe we can catch this asshole while he's running away, in the next episode of course, and as always, I'll leave you with a hearty goodbye, goodbye.